What's good guys, it's your boy Shimon here back with another video, a brand new video, something different and something very interesting. So today I'm going to show you guys a program, shout out to the Ninja Turtles in the background. But this program is for everyone who uses iTunes, but they're not really a fan of iTunes. This program is way better than iTunes. All you guys need to do, make sure you have your device plugged in and ready up and stay tuned to hear all the details of what this program can do. So without any further ado guys, let's jump into the video. Alright guys, so I just want to hop over to your browser. I'm just going to show you where you could go to download the program. It's iMobi. So, what am I doing? Oh, is that my second channel? Anyways, <laughs> jump onto your new tab. The link will be down below in the description. This is called AnyTrans. It's the ultimate iPhone manager, guys. It's super, super dope. Trust me on this. It has tons of new features. I've been using like VShare and all those other ones, but this one is way better because of all the cool things you can do with it. You can even like download YouTube videos with this program, which is sick as hell. So guys, let me just show you a couple features, like the new features in what's new here. So as you can see, you have the two-way iTunes sync. That's dope. You have the new iPhone never empty feature. I know I'm going to talk about the iCloud feature next because that was normally a paid version, but it's in the free version. So if you have a new phone, you could just easily clone it. I'll talk about this like in depth for you guys. So if you're really into like file managing, backing up your devices, getting data on your device, off your device, this would be the best one for you guys. So one of my personal favorites is the control of personal data where you could easily back up stuff on your phone. So if you have a 5S like me, this program would be the best for you because you could be able to save your storage onto your desktop easily, safe and secure. So if you have like a ton of pictures, ton of music, you just port them over onto a file on your desktop and then you free up space on your phone. So here's the program on my desktop, AnyTrends. It opens like a beaut. Look at that animation, it opens so neat. I really like that animation right there. But if you guys are wondering why this is square because I'm using my friggin old pc but it's a beast so whatever so here we have like a game center look going on right here first thing first I recognize is my phone more life shout out to drake if you want more information you could click the i and it will show you like more stuff like the imi code and all of that crap so here we have a couple things like you could change the skin if you'd like you could download a couple skins right here if you don't like the white theme next up we have the itunes backup you could easily back up your device right here this is the iCloud content that is pretty dope. You could transfer your iCloud files. And then here's where we have all of the good stuff. And I mean, my favorite is content to PC. So you could remove content from your iPhone onto your PC. And that's the game changer. So here we are now. We could select the categories we want to drag from our phone onto our PC. So let me just show you guys what you could do. You could just save it to your desktop. Normally, we'll just save onto like the H file, but anyways, I just want to uncheck all of these because I'm just doing it for the video so you guys know how it works. And this is like I'm just showing you guys that it works and how good it works. If you wanted, you could like remove everything from your phone within these categories and put it onto a folder on your laptop. But, anyways, I just selected voice memos right here, so you could see I'm just transferring all of those onto my PC right now. Simple as that, it's finished. If you look closely, you see the AnyTrans folder that's been created on my desktop. If I open that, you can see the voice memos. These are all of my voice memos that I have recorded onto my phone. And that's sick. Now, that's what impressed me, and that's why I really like this one over like the rest of programs. iTunes can't do this. Look, even my iBooks. This is a file that I downloaded this morning to study while I was on the bus going to school. And I also download, downloaded this untitled file, which is my first class for the day. So I normally read my notes on the bus before I reach this class. So when teachers asking questions, I, I sound like a smart ass kid. But actually, I just read the notes before class. But anyways, guys, yeah, that's like some of the main features with this program. But as I said before, you could even download like music. You could download a lot of things from YouTube. So what else we can do right here, if you're going to Safari, you could check your Safari history and your bookmarks if you want. You could check your photos straight from here, which could be convenient to some people, but I'm not really a fan of this part. But as I said before, it has a bunch of options you could choose from. So if I go into my camera roll here, 
as you can see these are all my camera roll images I saw that Tulsa Tesla yesterday had to snap a pic shout out Pony at me DDG so if I want to drag like even a picture from my phone to my desktop simple as this you just choose which files you want I just want to bring that Jamaica one then you want to go to the you could upload it to your iCloud if you if you want you could delete straight from here or you could send to your other device but you need to connect another device to the PC and then you could just send it but anyways let me just send to desktop real quick I'm gonna skip the free trial boom transfer complete transfer more let me say I want to transfer music now this is the game changer to be able to like send music from one device to another is super super cool iTunes can't let you do that I don't know any program out there that can let you do that so for example here if I select chill day I could send it to iTunes or send it to another device and that's what I really like like if I connected on another iPhone to it I could send it over to the iPhone but anyways let me just send it to the desktop as you can see all the files are here the camera roll set up right there music right here everything is just chilling bro so yeah that's basically it for this video if you like this program you could check it out links below in the description it's free so you don't have to worry about anything and always guys remember love peace and tweaks signing out